Fifteen years ago, I was drug addicted. I was homeless. It was a crisis moment in my life with young children. And there were women that helped to empower me. They taught me how to give to others. My name is Stephanie Bowman, and I'm the founder and director of One Heart for Women and Children. One Heart for Women and Children helps well over 2,000 people a month right now. And they come from all different walks of life. We all want to be loved. It doesn't matter how much or how little we have. Where are you staying? Uh, I'll stay right now. Okay. You're, you're good. Good. Right. good to see you, darling. You've been through a lot. I've been walking a lot. Do you need some shoes? Yeah, they do. And it's not about judging anybody, wherever it is that they are now or where they've been. They say the homeless people is the worst thing in the world. I don't think so. We just want to be treated as a human being. I just be who I am. Thank you. It's about hearing each other so that we can help them to be able to get to that next place. First, I just want to say thank you guys for being here. Impacting the community by feeding the hungry, it's a big need. What we'll hear today is I'm so grateful that you're here because I haven't eaten in a couple days. And you know, it can happen to any of us. It was me once upon a time ago. Thank you. In this last three months, more than 50% of what we do is feeding hungry families. We partnered with Second Harvest Food Bank. As a result of that, we give away over 10,000 pounds of food each month. That's a lot of food. What we found is that there were a lot of families that were here volunteering that were in need. So we've got a voucher program that's $10 an hour that matches every hour. Over 50% of the children here in Central Florida go to bed hungry at night. That's huge. When a person look in the refrigerator and they have kids, they don't know what they're going to do. It's a blessing because now everybody can eat. It makes a great difference in the community. One Heart for Women and Children is made up of a lot of people. It's an honor to be recognized by the Lady Godiva program for the work that we do. I believe that if people aren't helping each other as a community, we're in trouble. If we think a little less of ourselves and a little more of another human being, we're in a pretty darn good place.